scores in Flash. Think about where you want your score to go. Make sure that you've got a dynamic text box selected and give it a value. We'll go three for lives and a name, a variable name that you can use in the code. We'll call it lives. Now we go to the code. Figure out where we want our lives to go down and it's here when the ball goes under 350. We no longer want it to go to a stop. You lose the first time it goes below 350. We want lives to go down by one. So mine is minus. And it goes down. And it continues to go down because it's keeping going down. We need to do something else here. In this particular game, lives are working, but we need to reset the balls. Underscore Y. We'll take it up to zero. So we miss. Goes up there again. The, the only thing that I'll mention in this short and sweet is sometimes that doesn't work. So if it doesn't work, you do this. Up here, you go an internal variable. And you have that variable go down. And then assign that value to the lives, which is back on the stage. You're not going to see any difference when I play this. But again, with the one variable, if it works, great. But if it doesn't work, then try it the second way that I showed you. That's it. Scores, short and sweet.